This sounds very much like predatory play aggression. And it's really important that you can actually curb this behaviour because it can escalate really, really quickly. So starting off as a low risk assessment, it, it can easily increase to a high risk assessment. Um, the way that you can do this, you've obviously already started to bring different types of enrichment into the cat's life, making sure that um, she's got a high or he or she, oh it is a she, sorry, making sure that she's got a really high protein food content. So that's going to give her a feeling of fuller for longer, um, making sure you play before food. And then each time um, she actually goes to try and get hold of you, try and intercept that if you can with a distraction. You can use interrupt cues, a form of classical conditioning as well. I think there's some videos on that. There's also some videos on um, predatory aggression directed towards you as a caregiver. You'll find them on the playlist as well. Making sure you've got your pheromone support in the environment as well, that can really, really help. She's only one at the moment, so the, the chances are that she's behaving a bit like a naughty teenager and this behaviour is going to increase until she's about 18 months to two years old. So it's really important that you can actually stop this behaviour happening in the first place.